it's just a sensation. It's very hard to explain the sensation you get when you're out on the boat. Um, there's no one else around, especially in training, the early mornings, um, seeing the sunrise, the sunset, just that peacefulness, just you and the boat, just hearing the water lap at the side of the boat. It's, it's just a great sensation. For me, being in a single skull, I think that's the, that's the one thing is no matter what I do, um, I can either be successful or not successful, but there's no one to blame apart from myself. I'm the only person in that boat uh, without the side of the team that works with me throughout training, coach and support staff and everything. Um, when you, you push out off the pontoon and you sit at that start line, it's just you and the boat. Um, there's no one else you can sort of fall back on. One of the biggest things that I'm trying to push throughout the world in para rowing is that the para rowers are elite athletes. We train as hard as everyone else and racing 2K has just shown the world that we're able to do it. We might be have various medical conditions, but we don't let it affect us. Um, that's the one thing about rowing, Paralympic Games especially, there's 12 nations. We're all going for that one thing. And I honestly think if you give no respect to your competitors, um, you're doomed from the word go. So I am determined, but I guarantee the other 11 athletes that are gonna be in Tokyo are as determined as I am. I mean, I mean we might race for different countries, but we, we all love the one thing, and that's, that's the sport. We love that sensation. You lose a fellow competitor. I think it's, it's hit the para community very hard. Um, and I hope that going forward, we can learn from this and, and move forward, but never forget. Uh, I think that's one of the biggest things is that we can never forget. It'll always be a champ. So I think that's one of the biggest things. I think um, every athlete that pushes off that pontoon, as far as I'm concerned, are champions. Um, they're representing their country and yeah, he certainly, um, I think, has yeah, represented his country extremely well. And I think that's one of the, the biggest things that people need to remember is um, that he's a champ and he'll always have the perfect stroke.